Hi, I'm John Case from Locks and Keys, here to tell you a little bit about transponder, chip keys, and remotes for today's cars. Older model cars didn't use transponders, it would start up just by turning the ignition key. In the late 90s, transponder keys were introduced and several variations became more and more popular over the years. The transponder, or chip, is an electronic device that is the head of the key and programmed to the car's computer. When a key is turned in the ignition, the computer must recognize it, otherwise the car will not start. We at Locks and Keys have stayed on top of the technology over the years and have the equipment to duplicate or create keys from scratch if they're lost for most cars. There are many ways to add a transponder key to be recognized to your car's computer. We here now to discuss three of the most popular methods. One is onboard programming. Certain keys can be made in our store in the Wuben Mall that allow you to program them yourself with the simple instructions we supply. Two is key cloning. This is where we read the chip of your current key and transfer the information from one chip onto the new key. Your computer will recognize the key and allow the vehicle to start. Third method is for the locksmith to go out to your car and plug into your car's computer. We are then able to add new keys, program new keys if lost, or even remove keys that have been lost or stolen. Our locksmiths can also program auto remotes or remote head keys to your car. Call Locks and Keys at 781-933-9999 or visit our website at www.24hourlocksmiths.com.